Good morning, folks. Today we're going to hit a couple good articles on magnetism in the body, a confirmation of solar forcing of temperatures, we are one day away from the e-magazine mega release, and of course, we are starting with the last 24 hours on our star, where solar flaring took a little uptick in excess x-ray production frequency. Luckily, these are still impulsive events and didn't produce much in the way of CMEs. The limb eruptions did produce a bit of CME activity, but those are not aimed at Earth. The coronal holes continue turning through, but thus far the solar wind enhancements have been minor. Geomagnetic conditions are calming from the storm events a few days ago, and stability has set into the stream. Eruptive focus as the sunspots depart becomes these two plasma filaments flanking the southern reach of the coronal hole. We'll be monitoring those for eruptions today as the big sunspot group begins departing near the limb. First up in today's articles hits the Hindu Kush region of northern Pakistan. They find significant cyclicity to their climatic conditions, suggesting that the solar cycle plays a critical role in determining temperature fluctuations, specifically in their warmer versus colder summers. This likely has to do with the long and short-term forcing pathways of oscillations and joule heating, respectively. Up next, we've got an interesting one on the lasting impact of space stressors on pregnancy. They find that these stresses, including radiation exposure, create risk for the process even after they have returned to Earth. Observers should consider this in terms of the magnetic pole shift relating to higher radiation levels penetrating down into the atmosphere. Lastly, folks. Good one here mapping cognitive centers and magnetic senses in vertebrates. These studies are getting very finely tuned compared to the breakthrough studies of years ago, not only confirming the magnetic impact on behavior, but where in the brain it works its magic. Another thing to consider in the ongoing magnetic pole shift. Folks, tomorrow we will be releasing the whole catalog of our e-magazine, whether you signed up on day one or you sign up today. By tomorrow. You will have access to everything, every key science update on the Earth disaster cycle, space weather, solar forcing of the atmosphere, electroquakes, and more. It's the best way to support both the observers and your continued awareness of our changing environmental condition. Link is below. We greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now, it's 5.45 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.